Four years ago, I was the reporter of a BBC Panorama programme examining accusations of anti-Semitism in the Labour Party. Um, and the programme's central thrust was that it had markedly increased since Jeremy Corbyn had been elected Labour Party leader, and that neither he nor some of those close to him um, had done sufficient to um, try to eradicate it. Um, these past four years have seen a very determined, uh, not to say at times obsessive campaign to try to discredit almost every aspect of the programme uh, by uh, Corbyn supporters, uh, by alt-left media activists, uh, and by some journalists who think uh, the crisis was exaggerated, um, concocted even. Now, um, dismantling this particular edition of Panorama has become sort of central to the uh, Corbyn sympathising media's argument that the um, history of the crisis needs to be rewritten. And that when it comes to values like fairness, evidence, facts, rigour, um, it is they who have the high moral ground. Um, starting today, over the next uh, three editions of Fathom, um, I explain why, in my view, forensic analysis of the ground they have chosen to fight on demonstrates the precise opposite. And I also point out, in my view, the danger inherent in their version of history becoming settled on the left.